let's talk synergy and meals. What does your body really need to feel full, to reach your goals, to be healthy? I like this photo of my face. It looks like I'm telling David, did you get the photo yet? These wings are amazing, but seriously, did you get the photo? When you're thinking about how to take care of your body, it's kind of like playing chess. If I move here and then that happens and you're trying to think three moves ahead. I wanted to be creative and take you behind the scenes as a clinical dietitian, managing my patients have taught me so much about the basics of how to take care of oneself. I'm going to talk a little bit about how we keep our patients alive by feeding them through their veins. It's called total parenteral nutrition, meaning you get your complete nutrition hung in a bag. Imagine, we eat well-balanced meals through our mouth. So if we were to take a blend of a well-balanced breakfast, a blend of a well-balanced lunch, and finally a blend of a well-balanced dinner, somehow that all has to be in a solution that pharmacy compounds that we hang and it keeps our patients alive. Or we can also keep our patients alive by feeding them through a feeding tube. And they have these commercial supplements that are perfectly balanced. Well, I'm not going to use the word perfect. They're as close as we can get to everything that the body needs to thrive. So just like us, we're trying to figure out what do we eat to be energetic, feel great, and get to this body that looks strong and healthy. So as a dietitian, I come through and I look at your height, your weight, your past medical history, I look at your labs to see how well we're doing, and I adjust all of the formulas to get your electrolytes right, your vitamins and minerals, keep your skin intact, make sure the GI is working well, adjust the potassium, which affects the heartbeat, look at the magnesium if you've not been eating well for a while, and all of that in equations to keep you from crashing out. I had to include this photo of little Rook. She's grown up so much. So how do you fuel your family, right? We all want to understand the body better. Let's talk about it. We need acid, like vinegar. So simple, it's acid-base balance. And salt, everyone wants to avoid salt, but salt is a part of the basic equations. You need your macronutrients, which is your carbs. Carbs also look like desserts and candy. Yes, when we feed our patients through their veins, carbs are called dextrose or glucose. It's sugar. Sugar at the simplest level travels to the brain and keeps the brain alive and nourished. We also have to have the other macronutrient protein. We call it amino acids when we're looking at formulas. And then the third macronutrient is fats. Yes, that includes the butter, my favorite. And then hydration. So all of that added with some water to keep the kidneys alive, keep the urinary system working, and we call that synergistically blended for digestion, metabolic functioning, to keep a patient's heart beating, their lungs expanding. And this is just showing you how it travels to the stomach. There's digestive enzymes that interact with the food we eat as it travels through the small intestine, breaking down into simple glucose, yes, sugar, to travel to the bloodstream, to get to the liver, the brain, and all of the cells that keep your body breathing and alive. So no matter how you cut it, the most important thing is to have those blend, that synergy, at your meals. If you want to do three basic meals a day, that's fine. Just like the periodic table, all those little micronutrients are found in your food. Try not to overthink it. Just know, let's start simple. Three balanced meals per day. Get your protein, like eggs, chicken, pork, fish. Your carbs, like breads, pastas, rice, fruit. Your fats, butter, olive oil, nut butters, dairy, fatty cuts of meat. And your hydration, water, tea, coffee. And you know I'm always trying to help people learn to be empowered and keeping it simple. So when you have those well-balanced meals, try not to overthink it. Just do a good job. Say, body, I have breakfast, lunch, and dinner. I have my protein, my carb, and fat. 
it's fresh, it's colorful. This is what I know my body needs on a cellular level to thrive. And if it's good, then just trust your body that it's going to break down all that beautiful nutrition that you just provided for it. And it's going to know what to do from there. Your job is just to provide the good, healthy, loving, nurturing meals. And then synergy is the next step. And that is done naturally by the body on a cellular level. I hope this has taught you a different thought perspective on how metabolism works. Look forward to seeing you guys in the next video.